All right, Jimmy would not start. He got started, but then a little bit later he died. Uh, could not get him started again. Tried replacing the fuel filter, even though it was fine. There's just a little bit of brown fluid on the backside. Uh, and I still wouldn't start, and I ended up taking out the carburetor filter. I mean, it does look kind of dirty. Anyway, this fixed it, taking this out. So we'll just drive without it for a little bit until I get to town. Pumping pressure, but that is clogged. Also gonna grab a new air filter while I'm down there. It's about time. guys made it to an O'Reilly's I'm gonna go in and get uh, that's a sweet work truck holy moly go in and get us some filters and a couple other small things main priority today is getting food about to do one to replace that filter Jimmy didn't do this time, but he was dieseling up at the gas station pretty bad. I can put another 10 bucks in the tank just in case, and 10 in the can. Yeah, he diesels just like patches, so I guess I gotta run mid grade in Jimmy as well. That is freaking neat. I love that I have cruise control. All right, you guys, spent about 40 bucks on a filter, air filter, thermostat carburetor filter and a couple radiator caps switch out this fuel filter real quick Five eighths of 
fuel filter. There's the old one. Spring. You can't lose that. They don't come with them for some reason. you need. So let's see, I think that goes like so, and this goes like so. Or does that go like so? No, yeah, it has to go like this. Because there's nothing for that to... Okay. Let's put this all back in there.
Jesus played the stuff. Definitely overflowing. Need to get us a bigger reservoir. Asked them if they had any, but nothing's in stock, of course. Good to go. back to the ranch. There's a little dieseling. Yep, gotta put some mid-grade in them. Actually, I'm gonna walk over to Walmart first and get me a cheap bike cable for locking up fuel tanks or gas cans. Oop! That would be bad. Need to give me one of those warning beeps. Jimmy looking good with those new shoes. Cheap bike lock. Picked up a cheap uh, measure tape, so I don't, so I don't always have to use my next one. And think toilet paper. So uh, almost that time to resupply the TP. Probably should have got paper towels too, but uh, things are going to be tight. So I'm trying to 
do better at spending less. So, all right, let's get some food and get out of here. All right, that works. trick is to put it in the gear if it's doing that that kind of helps stop it but we'll just uh I'll start putting mid-grade in them fixed patches issue all right successful mission to get uh, some parts filters and most importantly food holy Yeah, that is definitely filling all the way up. Out yeah, the top, it's getting rusty again too. It's probably uh, still working loose, a bunch of rust in here. Off the radiator and off the heater core. There might be a couple changes before that stays clear. Or maybe uh, time for a new radiator or something. If it keeps rusting, I'm pretty sure. Uh, keep hearing a hissing coming out of that. Yeah. Now there's some air bubbles coming up. Yeah, I think uh, they might need a new head gasket. I mean, I'll try putting in a bigger reservoir, just find a gallon jug or something, stick it in there and see if that helps, but... I think it needs a new head gasket.